to go? Yeah, just give me a few minutes. I want to talk to Jack, okay? Yeah. I'll be right outside. How do you feel about this? I feel like this is the best thing possible for Liberty. This could be her cure. But whether it is or not, I'm, uh, I'm having a baby. <laughs> How do you feel? I miss my brother. I miss Brad. I wish you were here. But if this baby turns out to help his daughter, I think that'd be amazing. Yeah, but who knows? Maybe we won't even need the baby's I bone marrow. I mean, that would be I great. Just, I just, the, I just the want the what, what, what's work. ever best for her, that's all. And the baby. Our baby. Our, our baby. <laughs> So, when are we going to tell Liberty? We? We. Janet, you got to know that when you were thinking about doing this, she, she wasn't too happy about it. What? She went as far to say that if the baby turned out to be a match, she'd refuse the transplant. Well, I will just make sure that she knows that this is more than just a donor baby to me. Tell us. Well, thanks for the offer, but I think I'll tell Liberty myself, seeing as it's back to just her and me. Well, what about Dusty? He can stay, or he can go. I have no right to ask him for anything. What about Carly? What's she going to do when you tell her? She knew there was a chance it could turn out. She seemed okay with it. Well, now that it has, we'll see how long that lasts. Hey. I know you were hoping for a different answer. Yeah, I just thought with all the symptoms you had that... Yeah, well, you know, the not eating and being really tired probably was just stress over liberty. Yeah, probably. What are you doing? I'm giving this back. Thank you for... You think I'm taking back my proposal? You're not? No. I want to marry you, Janet. I've been waiting for you to call. I'm sorry. The baby's... Yours. Uh, I've been sitting here waiting for this phone to ring. The longer it went without ringing, the more I knew. I thought it'd be easier. Easier for me to hear it in person. I don't, I don't know. None of this seems real. But it is. Real. Dusty was so sure the baby was his. So much so that when the technician was doing the sonogram, I actually felt like I was intruding on some moment between him and Janet. And then in the next breath, the technician is saying that the baby's five weeks along and suddenly, I'm the dad. of you, of how much I need you.
thinking. Maybe we should sit the kids down, tell them what's going on. Yeah, we should probably do that. You want to? Mm, don't you think we should? This isn't something that's gonna stay hidden very long. Right. No, you're right. Sooner or later, it's gonna be obvious that Janet is pregnant. Oh, and that wasn't what you were talking about, was it? No. <laughs> He's talking about us, our relationship. I think we should tell the kids where we stand, you know? It, it could be confusing for them, especially if Dusty decides to break things off with Janet now that we know the baby is not his. Well, regardless what happens with Dusty, if Janet needs me for the baby or Liberty, I will be there as much as I can, but I am with you, and that's never going to change. And I am going to be a father again. Okay, why don't you, um, close your eyes and catch up on some of that sleep you missed out on last night. Mm, and where are you going? Oh, I'm going to do some errands that I couldn't get to earlier. You know, I'm going to head out to the station, because if I stay here, I could be thinking about braces, college funds, You know, I've never experienced a pregnancy like this before. What do you mean? Oh, from start to finish, knowing the baby's mine. Well, you're a wonderful father. And I know you will be again. Carly, I love you so much. I love you too. So Jack's the biological father of this baby, so what? So, you wanted to marry me because you thought I was pregnant with your child. That's not why I asked you to marry me. I love you, Janet. But you're not just going to have to promise to love me. You're going to have to love Liberty and this baby. You think I don't know this? Jack? I love Johnny like he's my own. We're going to get married. I showed you the other day. All of us. It was a beautiful house. It'll be our home. We're gonna be family. I'm gonna take care of you and the kids for the rest of my life. Tell me you don't want that as much as I do. I'm sorry. I can't marry you. I know you tried to kick me out of here before, but that's not going to happen again. <clears throat> you want to bet? <laughs> Looks like you're carrying Jack's baby. And Jack is with me now. Congratulations. So, for better or probably worse, we're all in this together. What do you want, Carly? Same thing you want. For Liberty to be well again. To do what's best for this baby. Meaning? I'm going to be here to help you with whatever you need. Instead of Jack. Get used to this face, Janet. You're going to be seeing a lot of it. Everything all right? Can I help you with something, Dusty? I know you're trying to be a good guy to Janet, but don't sweat things so much. What are you talking about? 
I'll take care of Janet. I'll be father to both of her kids. You're free to be with Carly. 